Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another episode of Teen Runaway. So obviously at the end of the last episode, basically Taylor is pregnant. So that's fun times. Um, obviously she's very, very tense right now because yeah, she she's she's not doing too good. But she's also like sort sort of happy, I guess. I guess she's also happy that uh that Paolo is sad as well, which is like weird, but I guess she's like happy that he's sad because that would be a whole nother thing if he was like happy about it. So yeah, they just got they have stuff that needs to be done. Um by the way I also like edited my reshade a bit so if the game looks a bit different that is why I think it actually like it's running like smoother than like it was before so I probably like turned some setting down or something I don't know I don't know I'm not I'm not very good with the whole reshade thing oh oh she has to go to work can we still go to work right now I forgot she can't she had she didn't go to work because she found out she was pregnant <laughs> she can't go to work now right okay just go to work look I think she should just go to work like it's not a big deal she doesn't look pregnant right now <laughs> she could just like tell them she's not pregnant it's fine it's fine so off a little Taylor goes and then when she gets back um, I'm gonna get her to these guys are having a talk oh god wait why is <laughs> Why does Harry look so much taller than him? He looks so much bigger than him, right? But he, but you guys are the same age, right? Yeah. Why does he look so much bigger than him? That's so funny. Anyway. So yeah, these guys are having the nice... Having a nice talk there. Oh, he's, he's leaving now. Okay, bye. Um, Yeah, he's saying bye. But he doesn't actually know that she's pregnant but uh, who who pranked our toilet if i flush the toilet before i go to the toilet will it like stop the prank maybe anyway but he doesn't really know and that may like we thought maybe like harry had some feelings that it doesn't anyway okay we're hiring a press over actually no he would repair it we're not gonna spend our money we can get harry good at um repairing stuff what what does he even have hand he doesn't even have handiest okay that's gonna turn out great. I just really, in this episode, I really just wanna get through um, Taylor's pregnancy. This series has been on hold for, not on hold, but like, I haven't posted in, in a bit because, I don't know, I was really into the whole, like, I pre-recorded like two episodes, the last two episodes of Snowy Stories, you guys saw, those were like pre-recorded and I just recorded them on the same day. I loved, I, I just loved like seeking that series so much. We're back though, I really wanna get not that I want this series to end, I just want to like get it over with because I have thought of a different like series I could do after this and that could take like the second slot of like a let's play on my channel and I'm, I'm I've thought of it like last night and I was I'm so excited about it because it's really it's a challenge I've wanted to do for a while but I've actually never done it before yeah it's a challenge so we're gonna okay he still needs to do that <laughs> come on bro come on man but yeah, if my game actually does look, please tell me if my game looks like different or it looks like better or you no know, worse, whatever, whatever you want to like say. Because I was like trying to do like reshade and I was trying to do like the shadow thing, like the MX something. But I'm not very good at reshade, so I don't even know. I just like messed my game up and I got, and I got like I updated reshade accidentally, and then it like messed the whole reshade up, so I had to like redo everything. So. That's why if it looks different, and also there's a new like setting, there's a new like uh, one of the new things on there or something. I don't know. Don't ask me. I'm not very like good at this stuff. Okay, just use that and then clean up because there's no point in cleaning it and then going to the toilet. Okay. Well, he did good at that, I think. Oh no, he pinched his finger. Okay. Why is he so big? Why is this man so big? Hello? Is that just is that just me? But he's does he look like really tall or something? But yeah. Just the whole, like, reshade thing. Anyway, just wanted to show, tell you guys that in case you were like, oh, wow, the game's so different. That's why. Um, I really want to, like, I, I, there's certain, like, reshades I want, but my computer just can't handle it. So there's really ni nice ones you can get, but this is all I have right now, which is, I, I still do like this reshade, but I don't know why I'm just rambling on now. Okay, 
Finish with the toilet, okay. And Taylor is back from work, so she is still really tense. She wants to grab a serving of some salad, which she can do, actually. I'll just get her to do this, and then... Yeah, she. I, I have my pregnancy just set to, like, three days. Um, I'm, I didn't, like, do it, like... You're actually kidding me. You just repaired that toilet and then you've just pra Why does Sims do that? I swear that's a glitch. I actually don't care. You can pee, pee on it and then you can, I I'm just gonna cheat repair that because honestly, so she's just gonna be tense for ages uh, because yeah, look what happened. Oh, so sad. Like your toilet broke. No, you are not going to bed. I'm gonna actually cheat repair this because that's so annoying. Okay, there we go. What is happening on our floor? Is that just me? Does on our floor look like gross? Like, I don't know what that is, but okay. It's 9 p.m. right now, and I'm, I'm pretty much just gonna get him to go to sleep. I don't see anything else he could do, so. Um, high school SG. Can I drop out of school? I want him to drop out of school, but. We'll just get him to go to sleep and then actually no 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 you don't you don't go to sleep don't go to sleep sleep yet because i want her to what's she listening to pop okay i'm gonna get her, her to come over to harry and we are going to announce our unwanted pregnancy <laughs> not to share big news we're going to announce that we do not want this okay Oh my god, he's actually so sad. Oh my god, he why is he crying? Okay, I don't think it was that bad. Did he get anything from it? Oh, I wanted. They got pregnant with didn't want to. Such a difficult situation, it makes her trouble to hear about it. Oh my gosh. Harry. Harry's so sad. Okay. Oh well. That's great. Okay, but I think she's just gonna go to sleep because honestly. Her energy is just going way down because obviously she has a child in there. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna get her to just do a little sleep. So fun times. <laughs> um, but yeah, this episode I really just want to get through Taylor's pregnancy. I'm just like obviously not excited for her to have a kid because it was never like planned for her to have a kid. But I guess I'm like kind of excited because you know it's like. Yeah, you know, it's still like a baby, I guess. <laughs> yeah, they're just gonna just gonna sleep and then get back to you guys in the morning. Okay, um, so Harry has work in an hour, so I think I'm just gonna get him up, I think. Yeah, he just needs to get his hunger up, so I'm just gonna have him get a quick meal of just some... Just have some cereal, yeah. And then I also, I don't want to get Taylor up yet, because she just needs the energy, you know. But she does need a wee, actually. But I saw down here, she has like the this uh, emote. So it says, motherhood worries from teen pregnancy. No matter how Taylor feels about the pregnancy, being a pregnant teen carries its share of freakouts. What will she do about school? How will she take care of the baby? Where will she find all the necessary money? How to deal with everyone's judgment? The list of worries goes on and on. I feel so bad for her. Second trimester in two days. Did I not change my pregnancy back to being... I swear to God, if I if I changed it, oh, I need a computer. Hang on, but yeah, I just thought that was really, really like, I feel so bad for her. Like, yeah, I just always feel like so, so bad for her, so bad for like teen pregnancy. <laughs> uh, six days, nah. We wanna three days. A game restart. Really, I'm gonna have to restart my game. Oh my God, should I do that now? I don't know if I want to do that right Okay. Yeah, I have to, don't I? Okay. I'll be back with you guys when I've restarted my game. <laughs> okay. I'm back. It's it's all good now. I think it should be okay. Yeah, 19 hours. Okay. Perfect. So, she is... She's not feeling good. Okay. Let's get you to come here and do the thing I told you... Do the thing I told you to do last time, but then it, like, glitched out, so... I had to, I have to make you go, yeah, again. When does he start work? Oh, five. That's kind of, kind of bad. Okay, I kind of want him, I know you can't, he can't really do this, but 
I want him to get a full-time job. Like, I don't just want him to be part-time. But I don't know how... I don't know how Tim can drop out of school. I swear, someone told me there was a setting for it. Like, to make him drop out of school, Sim commands. No, I don't want to do any of these. <laughs> Maybe in the computer? Why would it be in the computer, then? Is your population... Nah, it's not going to be in here, right? Teens quit school. Enabled. <gasps> Wait, can I actually do it now? Quit job. job I swear, if that makes burger. him quit being a coffee yes, stain gosh. remover. Give <gasps> yes! Quit! Yes! Okay, he has quit being a high school student. Sorry, but not sorry. Yes! Oh my god, he can stop being this weird coffee stain remover guy. So now, only Taylor is at school, which I think makes sense. Oh, she's just gonna boo herself. Okay. Yeah, get, get up, girl. I don't know whether to keep her in school because I feel like... I feel like... I don't know. No, no, no. I'm gonna make her quit as well. But we have got to... I forgot we actually have to do this, but we have to go and Boy, tell our Boy. parents that we are pregnant. Well, not me. I'm not pregnant, but Taylor's pregnant. So we have to go and tell them that she's pregnant, which will be so fun. Wow, amazing. Oh, maybe not. I'm going to unpin that just because I don't know if that's really the right atmosphere we want to have here, <laughs> you know. She's not really, I don't think she's really thinking that, you know what I mean? But she wants to be funny with him, sure, that's cool, I guess. But I'm gonna get her to also, oh my god, I can't believe I'm finally, it's literally like, what is it now? Like the ninth episode? Almost tenth? I think? Is it actually the ninth? It probably is. Okay, ninth episode, and I have only just decided that they're gonna quit school. <laughs> it's kind of fun getting the, getting the, the calls every day but we are gonna let them quit that so i can't believe i had that disabled this whole time okay now they just have their jobs which i think makes more sense and it can, sign up can make sense a lot of like teen pregnancy people people who have teen pregnancies they drop out of school when they do get pregnant anyway even if she goes back like even if she ends up going I think you can go into school as well, so, with that MCC setting, so, I'll just make her, like, go back if we want her to go back to school after she has the baby. She also, I didn't actually show this, but in the night, she actually had, like, a craving food, and she had, like, a, a healthy food craving, which is actually really funny. I guess that sort of makes sense, because literally all they eat is salad. I swear, if her parents are happy about her being pregnant. I'm suing them. <laughs> so she doesn't like them, so I'm guessing they'll probably take it pretty badly. And obviously this this whole like teen pregnancy, like unprotected thing and all the like um the, the moodlets and stuff is from <gasps> He's promoted! <gasps> we almost have a thousand simoleons. Oh my gosh. He's promoted to bean blender. Wow, I'm so proud of you. But also like I was gonna make you quit, but Maybe I don't need to. He got a 193 bonus. Like, that's that's pretty good. I think that's pretty good for now. Maybe I won't make him quit. I don't know if she would bring Harry as, like, emotional support to her parents' house. But then I'm like, mm, would she really do that, though? No, she wouldn't. So we're going to go by ourselves. We're not going to bring Paolo because... Oh, no, she's feeling sick. We're not going to bring Paolo because we're not going to do that. Um... That's not, you know, how you wouldn't really want to, your parents to meet, like, your partner and be like, lol, I'm actually pregnant. Here you go, you know? Oh, Harry, Aaron's showing something to Harry. Cool. Harry, I don't know what you're doing, my man, but I thought he was going to go in the bathroom for a second. I was like, bro, don't go in there. Maybe I'll just get him to play video games. I don't know, he has to do that for his thing. And then we're going to go to Taylor's parents' house. Which is obviously her parents are Veronica and George, who we do not like. They were in one of the first episodes. Not really very cool people, so this will be very, very fun. <laughs> okay, she's got her outfit on. Let's go and see her parents. <laughs> I'm actually so nervous for her. Why am I so nervous for her? 
this is a game. But let's go to see Tarthosa. I'm so excited about that. Anyway, uh, let's go to where they live. They live in Willow Creek. Just forgot where they lived for a second there. <laughs> okay, so here we are. It's actually really hot here. Oh, I forgot it's summer. Let's go knock on the door and let's go tell our parents. Look, she's like stressing out. Look. Oh my god. She is just stressing. I am nervous for her. Can you actually see that she's pregnant from this outfit? You can actually a little tiny bit. So let's go and see her parents. We obviously don't- oh. She's stomping. Oh. Please don't tell me you're going to work. I need to tell you something. Mum, please. No, don't leave. Don't leave, don't leave, don't leave. Please don't leave. Because I have to tell you something. Okay, okay. Come tell your mum first, because your mum has to go to work. I forgot she has work and stuff. Okay. Just um, announce your unwanted pregnancy. And then we'll do it to her dad later. I don't know what even know where her dad is. Okay. She is already very angry. And she's going to announce that she's pregnant. <gasps> oh my god. She's crying. <gasps> oh god. That is not looking too good. Yeah, that's not going to help with her little emotion there. Let's go and tell our dad. 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 Um, look. Uh, I'm sorry to tell you this, but look. She's thinking about, like, abortions and stuff, which I don't think she would. I still think. Oh, this is from uh, Woohoo Wellness. Teenage child pregnant. The Sims just learned that a teenage child being pregnant. Will they react well often support? No. She would definitely not be supportive. She would definitely be like, no, this is like, we are not going to support you, you know? They are definitely that sort of parent. Okay. Oh my god. Worst case scenario. Taylor's parent reacted very poorly to news of pregnancy. Angry words flew. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay. Let's see what her dad thinks. I think her dad would, like, he's obviously, or, or, like, He's also going to be like, what the heck? Uh, so but like, imagine your daughter like runs away and she comes back literally pregnant. <laughs> Go on, announce it to him. Oh no, she is. Oh my god, he is so angry as well. Oh no. This is not going well. Is it going to tell me with him as well? Yeah, it is, because they're going over here. Yeah, no, we're going to refuse to support her. And the baby. Okay. Yeah, she is not feeling too good. Okay. She's also literally going to throw up, so that's great. She's going to go clean up for her parents, apparently. But yeah. Oh, our mom just kicked over the trash can. Okay. Is there anything else we can do with them? Like, can we... Can I do anything else? Like, ask for advice, ask for money. Maybe ask for advice. Like, I don't know if she's going to take it very well, but, like, ask her for advice. Like, maybe be like, I know you're not going to, like, support me or, like, give me money or anything, but, like, can you at least, like, support me in that, like, you know? You, like, can you just at least give me some advice on what to do, you know? She'd be like, yeah, get out of my house. Okay. <laughs> I feel like with her dad, uh, I don't think he would... Oh, lifestyle in progress. Harry's got a lifestyle. Oh, this is hers, not Harry's. Okay. Never mind. Okay. Ask for advice. Oh, does she refuse to give advice? Nothing to gain here from us. Considering their reaction to the pregnancy announcement, Taylor should have known better than to ask his parent for advice. She's not even giving us advice. Oh my god, Veronica. No, girly. Oh my god. Look, we need to just like... Can we just have like an argument? Throw a drink at her face, yeah. Do that. Just, like, do that and then leave. That's perfect, right? Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Oh, Dad's here too. Oh. <laughs> she used to drink her face. Oh, my God. I cannot believe that they... They are so angry with her. Girl, run away. Run away. Come over here. I feel like she'd just be like... Come on, let's just leave. Leave them. Don't worry about it, Taylor. You're fine, you're fine. Yeah, just leave them, just leave them. Okay. No, I said run away. She's literally like casually walking out. 
Why is she even doing that? Okay, let's go. Can I not jog here? Okay, it's because she's pregnant, isn't it? Okay, let's just go. Come on. Oh, she is so angry. I guess our next step is sort of to, like, talk to Paolo about it. I know we talked about, like, in the other, um, in the last episode, because obviously you had to tell him that we were pregnant, but we have to, you know, talk about our steps and if, like, Paolo's going to move in and, like, oh, my God, she's literally, like, so over here crying. She is not doing too good. Um, can we, like, go out here? Can we, like, do you think she'd like fishing? Probably not, right? Okay. Actually, we're going to travel to, maybe we should go to Paolo's house. And he lives with his parents. I feel like we have to do that, right? Okay, let's go to pa to Paolo's house. So we are here at Paolo's house. This is his apartment, actually. Oh my god, he's sad too. Okay, we need to talk to him. Let's all oh, shed sadness. She feels like sad because he's sad. God, we don't have time for that. Discuss possibility of terminating pregnancy. We can offer to go to early parenthood class after they want children. I feel like she'd first be like organizing to provide for the baby, and then we would pro they probably probably discuss the possibility of terminating it. I feel like they'd discuss it, but like I don't think they'd actually go and do it. I don't know. I just feel like Taylor's not that sort of person. I just feel like she she just always like wanted kids anyway, you know. So I feel like oh well, that's not really yeah the, that's not really the vibe we're going for here. Moan about him for not using birth control, that'd be yeah. definitely her, Should she'd be, be doing though. that. She's probably so annoyed at him. Um, uh, and then let's uh, discuss the hopelessness, definitely. Okay, she's like moaning about it. Wait, 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 what? Was that good? Not dealing well from discussing sad pregnancy to learn it together does not really solve anything but makes you feel less alone. Oh, it's kind of good though that he feels the same way if you like really wanted the baby i think that we have like a bigger issue no need to worry let's go here and knock on the door because obviously we didn't bring paolo because we know we knew that her, her, our parents would be like annoyed but let's see how paolo's parents react <laughs> so this is um paolo's dad this is dan that's what his dad name i've ever heard dan hi dan she literally announced her pregnancy before she even introduces herself. Is his mum not here? That's sad. Okay, so we're just 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 telling his dad today. We'll just say that he like already told his mum. So yeah, this is what's going on with them. I had a child together. Um, let's just. I love how Paolo's just in the back. He's like, please just go tell my dad, bro. He will be on our family tree after this though because we are having his his grandchild. <laughs> He's crying too. Does it like register? It doesn't register him as anything, does it? Like he's not directly in our family. I don't think the game like registers that it's her like boyfriend's dad, you know? Oh, I guess they are like, they are getting along a bit. Like she, he doesn't see, he's not like sad or <laughs> I'm like Paolo over here. Oh my gosh. Paolo is like losing it over there. I mean, he could actually move in with us, but I don't think that, I don't think they would just move in together i don't know she has a second trimester in nine hours i'll probably get to her second trimester today and then i'll like in the episode okay i think we should go home because this has been awkward enough so nice meeting you guys but we need to leave so we're back um oh our total is 590 that's so expensive what why is it that expensive that makes no sense anyway Let's just come in here, just, she just wants some food, just like get her to have a quick meal, just have like a peanut butter jelly sandwich. Yeah, sure. Just go have one of those, girl. I'm actually going to give her, I think I'm going to, in between this episode and next episode, when she goes into her second trimester, I'm going to give her some new, like a new, like everyday outfit for her like pregnancy, even though I don't think she'd go like fully like maternity, obviously because she is a teenager, you know. Like, this would be different if it was she was, like, an adult and she had it, like, planned and stuff. I feel like you go, like, maternity wear and stuff like that. But I guess she still needs to be comfortable, you know? This doesn't look like a very comfortable outfit when you're pregnant. Like, it really, like, has, like, straps on it and stuff. So, yeah, I'll probably just get her, like, a, a dress or something. Or, like, yeah, just something like that. Really, like, comfy. Even though I don't really want to go, like, fully, like, maternity. Because 
I don't think she would go fully maternity, is what I'm trying to say. Let's sit play Sims forever. Is she listening to lullabies? She's listening to lullabies. I'm actually going to put this keg away because I don't feel like she have that out when she's pregnant. Like, that makes no sense. Oh, we have to tell our friends, don't we? What, who is our... We have to tell Tina. Yeah, Tina, come... She just heard me. I swear Tina just heard... I was like, mm, we need to tell our friends. We need to tell Tina. And she's right here. Okay. Tina, girly. Let me just announce my pregnancy. Hi. Uh, I am pregnant. Uh, if you couldn't tell. Even though you can't tell because she doesn't have a bump or anything. But announce unwanted pregnancy. And then we can go to the toilet. And then he can come out here. Just do some cleaning, please. We need someone to clean around here. This has been like a telling everyone episode. Okay, she is pregnant. Let's see what Tina says. Oh, Tina's like really like. Oh my god, they're synchronized crying. That's what besties do, man. He's gonna not do that, and he's gonna come and talk to Tina. Just like, just just talk to her, you know. I really want her to go into her second trimester today, but it's it's, it's in seven hours. So, okay, try to calm down. I'll just get her to try and. Just try and calm down. Try and like at least like make try and make yourself feel a little bit better. Maybe to try and make herself feel better, we are gonna go and buy something for the baby. We are gonna go buy something that's really nice for the baby. Maybe it'll make her feel better. Oh my god, these guys can't even talk to each other. What is happening? Okay, let's see what she bought. Oh she bought a little chompy the monster. Cute. Taylor doesn't want this child, but is trying to act like someone who wants it, hoping it may help. Uh, I don't know if I don't know if it's really like helped her, but yeah. So I actually don't know how we're like where we're gonna put this baby, like how we're gonna even. She's I think she's just really stressing out. Like what are they even gonna do? You know. At least she's got a cute little toy for it though. Oh, they have like the cute little pictures. Let me put that up on the wall. I'll put that in his room. Or would she have it in her room? No, no, no. Put it in his room. The walls are so grimy. Okay. She can't even, like, research anything because she's too tense. Like, she can't even do that because she's too tense. Um, is there anything else we can do with, like, pregnancy? Oh, she got an emotion. Okay. She's sad, not ready for this from pregnancy. Sometimes the torturous nature of being pregnant at a time when you don't want a child hits you like a train. Oh, my God. I feel so bad for her. Why have I put her through this? I'm probably just going to get him to have a full-time job, maybe. Because I actually need to, like, provide for this child. I feel like he would be a really good, like, sort of father figure, really. But, like, he actually probably won't be with Tina. I'll probably add someone else for Harry. Because I swear him and Tina don't even get along. And it's really annoying. Noisy neighbours. I'm just going to get her to go and get her crave food. Because, honestly, like, she just needs to go get that. We're going to miss it. By like a few seconds. She is now in her second trimester. It looks like Taylor is back. And let's see what the amulet says. I'm one to pregnancy second trimester. This pregnancy is not getting any better. There is still time to make a different different decision, but Taylor's just not sure. No matter what she does, the damage is done and there will be no going back from this. Life is permanently altered. I feel so bad for her. This episode has just made me realise how much how like bad I feel for Taylor. But yeah, so the second episode, actually, let's see her little tum tum now. <gasps> She's so cute pregnant though. Sorry, but she is. Um, but the next episode will, I, I will give her a little new um, everyday outfit for her pregnancy just so she like looks, I think she'd just go a bit more casual so she's not as, you know, as uncomfortable in her as she is now in her regular outfit. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I feel so bad for Taylor and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.